back from walking this trip. Some of the things that we bought were these nectar bath treats and we have an amazing tub. So we're going to be um, putting the bath bombs in those tonight after dinner. So these are the nectar bath bombs we're gonna be using and it'll be really nice to just relax after walking all day. And now I'm going to get all ready, do makeup, do hair, get dressed and get ready for dinner. So we're actually running late, but we are all ready for dinner. Who's excited? There's the birthday girl. We're going to be going to Tao restaurant. It's like an Asian bistro. I got the sushi and chow feng. What'd you get? I got the filet mignon, the black pepper filet mignon. Ooh. And what did you get? And I got sushi, hot and sour soup with lobster, what was it? Ravioli, like that? Yeah. And then we had a little bit of dessert for her birthday. So we're back and we are so excited because we're gonna do a little bubble bath with the bath bomb. What flavor are you going to use? Um, I'm going to do the pink one. The pink one, we got the same. I think it was like acai. Acai bowl. Yeah. So it is day two and we drove all the way from Vegas down to Flagstaff in Arizona. Jessica, the birthday girl right now, she's currently getting her massage. She already went and she had an amazing time, she says. How was it? Oh, it was really great. Oh God, it was relaxing. It's rejuvenating. Mm -hmm. Walked out, just took a couple of naps when I walked out and felt like oh, ready to conquer the world. So we did the anti-stress and anxiety massage combined with cranial sacral therapy with organic essential oils. Yes. Such a long name, but it's 70 minutes. And this place is called Flagstaff Holistic Spa. So yeah, I'm so excited to just, you know, relax. I'm gonna be next. So we just got here to the hotel. It's pretty nice for, you know, being so close to the Grand Canyon because it can get a little bit pricey over there. And we are close to one of my favorite pasta places. So this is the pasta. I just got regular spaghetti with um, marinara and meatballs, but oh my gosh, the marinara at this pizza and pasta place is so good. Tomorrow morning, we have to get up super early because we have to get to the Grand Canyon around eight o'clock. We're going to, um, be hiking the South Kebab Trail. Also gonna be having like all of our gear, our backpacks, um, our trekking poles, our um, crampons. So I'll show a little bit more about that later. I just found out that the trail's actually six miles round trip and not six going out and back. So I thought it was gonna be 12 originally, so it shouldn't be too bad. So super excited about that and I'll see you guys later. So in my day pack, I'm going to be bringing some gloves, some GoPro and camera equipment, some water bottles. I was going to bring my hydration bladder, but it wasn't in the best condition. I'm also going to be bringing some trekking poles and some snacks and sandwiches along with my fleece pants and a windbreaker in case it gets cold. We're also going to be bringing some crampons, which are great for slippery or icy conditions on the road and trail.
made it. We're definitely gonna have to use our crampons because yeah. there is ice everywhere. So we're starting the trail right now. And we've literally heard like 10 different people say or pronounce it differently. It's kaibab. Kaibab, kebab. Kibab. You say kebab. <laughs> you say kebab. Oh my gosh. It's not, it's not a piece of meat. <laughs> we decided to park on the side of the, of the road and then we're just gonna like hike probably like a mile in and then start the actual trail. So you could also park at the visitor center and then take the shuttle over super excited because i've never hiked the grand canyon before i've only come to see it see the views take pictures also got the gopro super excited shout out to my boyfriend for letting me borrow it you ready all right yeah, we're about to go. Hey guys, we stopped um, in Jocelyn. I'm taking over Jocelyn's video for the moment because she is temporarily disabled. Poor Jocelyn, you want to tell your story? So, I tripped right now. I pulled my muscle and I want to cry. So, She's yeah. holding it together. I just felt really lightheaded because you know when you're like in pain like so much pain and like you just feel like you're about to have like a pass out pass out moment that's what happened so we'll see if i can make it down i don't know she might have to go up and we're gonna continue the down <laughs> i ain't stopping for no one <laughs> johnson you, gotta, you can go slow up we'll keep going. yeah I'll go slow what up if we catch you <laughs> but she picked the perfect like place to slip. I feel like any place would have been a good place. Because let me tell you, the view here, it's like... Immaculate. Oh, it's beautiful. Ooh, Let's show. Okay. How are you feeling? I'm okay. I'm just going to have to take it very easy on the way down now, unfortunately, because it hurts so bad right here. If you make it, I'll call you champ. And you get to pick dinner. The struggle is real.
for this craziness. I'm a bare face, no glasses, hitting my eyes. It's just crazy. We blew into, into the side of this rock. We're gonna have to make a run for it. So we have to take this trail. We have about a mile left to get to Skeleton Point. Yeah, like if we take off running that way, we have nothing to do. All right, so we're gonna take a run for it. We survived that crazy windstorm. Um, we made it to Skeleton Peak. Jessica got here before us and she already took off back up to the top. Also, look, there's a path down here. You can keep going. So I actually got something in my eye. It took about what, 20 minutes to get it out. Um, but we are now headed back up. So we gotta hike all the way up there. sandwiches we finally found Jessica she was patiently waiting for us Take a little break. Such a good <laughs> final thoughts. It was tough, but well worth it. It's amazing. I loved it. Every every step, every view. It's definitely crazy to see 
God's creation like this. It was worth it every step of the way, even though I was injured at one point, but I'm still injured. So we are excited. <laughs> what? She's scared. I was like, oh, Jessica, we need to rescue her mom. How do you even deal with that in the house? <laughs> which is an Italian place. So we're in a French place and an Italian place. You can see behind me the view um, and having a lovely time. Yes, we're having a beautiful time. There's a little bit of drone next to us. The place is beautiful. The atmosphere, the drinks, the delicious food. It's cute. It's not stereotypical French, but it is French looking. Look at this, look at this velvet seating. Oh, so it's nice. Oh, just look at it. <laughs> Enjoy. <laughs> I'll sound the same, but in French it's doulou, and then you ask for it in a, in English it's carrot, in French it's carrot, and a take it water. And in France there's no ice. It's always going to be lukewarm. Is it really what? So I got the eggs benedict, and what did you get? We got the, um, the chicken, chicken and waffles. waffles, and then Jessica got the same thing as me. Oh, you got the same thing as me. Oh, we got the same thing. Hello. Yes. Jocelyn and Thea are going to try this cargo for the first time. Let's see. It's delicious, but we'll see. Let's go. You like poke all the way through. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Kind of snail with a puff pastry. Ready in one, two, three. Mm. Right? It's like intense, right? Like the what these were called? It's the Southern Magic Mountains. That's what they're actually called. <laughs> and what were you guys actually calling them? I was calling them the Magic Mountain. And she said it was the Seven Colorful Stones. No, I thought it was the Seven Magic Stones. <laughs> I thought they were the Seven Magic Rocks. I know. No. Why can't we get anything right on this trip? What it's know. called, how it's pronounced. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to Google again because it would say rocks or stones. <laughs> So we're out here at the crystal shops, and guess what? You want to show us your bag? Ooh, what's that? About to take a bath in this wonderful tub. 